Hello guys and welcome back to Best Car Picks. Isuzu has revealed a new 2.2-liter turbo diesel four-cylinder engine for the D-Max and MUX, but it doesn't spell the end of the venerable 3.0-liter. The engine goes on sale in Thailand on November 28, 2024 in both the D-Max and facelifted MUX, but has yet to be confirmed for Australia. Likewise, the facelifted MUX has yet to be locked in for Australia. In Thailand, the new engine, named RZ4F internally, is based on and replaces the current entry-level 1.9-liter turbo diesel 4 RZ4E. Given Isuzu also builds the BT50 for Mazda, it appears likely the 2.2-liter will replace the 1.9-liter in that model, too. While it is exciting to see that Isuzu continues to innovate with new powertrains, we currently are not in a position to comment on future product plans, an Isuzu Ute Australia spokesperson told. While the 2.2 liter is expected to be a step in the right direction towards meeting lower emissions targets, at this point in time, details of the new powertrain are yet to be confirmed. That said, Isuzu Ute Australia is committed to working towards providing a choice of vehicles that are not only compliant with all local legislation, but are fit for purpose and meet the needs of Australians. The 2.2-liter engine, marketed as the 2.2 DDI Max Force, produces 120 kilowatts of power at 3,600 revolutions per minute and 400 newton meters of torque between 1,600 and 2,400 revolutions per minute. It's mated to an 8-speed automatic transmission, which Isuzu says brings improved performance and fuel economy. The 1.9 liter it replaces produces 110 kilowatts and 350 newton meters and is mated with a six-speed auto. It narrows the gap in outputs between entry-level and optional engines in the D-Max and MUX lineups, being down just 20 kilowatts and 50 newton meters on the 3.0 liter. A mild hybrid version of the 1.9 liter, revealed earlier this year, will remain on sale in Thailand in a single rear-wheel drive pickup variant. This produces an identical 110 kilowatts and 350 newton meters to the regular 1.9 liter. It's unclear at this stage if the 2.2 liter will eventually gain a mild hybrid system. While Isuzu hasn't published fuel consumption figures, it says fuel economy has been improved by up to 10% over the outgoing 1.9 liter. According to Australian figures, D-Max models with the 1.9 liter use between 6.7 liters and 7.0 liters per 100 kilometers. The new 2.2 liter now stacks up better against the entry-level turbo diesel engines found in the top-selling Ford Ranger and Toyota Helix. The Helix Workmates 2.4 liter turbo diesel 4 produces 110 kilowatts and 400 newton meters while the Ranger's single turbo 2.0 liter diesel 4 produces 125 kilowatts and 405 newton meters. The Isuzu models also use an 8-speed auto, while the Helix and Ranger use a 6-speed. Isuzu's 4J 3.0 liter turbo diesel 4 does fall short in outputs compared to rival Ranger and Helix models. Its 140 kilowatts and 450 newton meters figures are beaten by the Helix's available 2.8 liter, 150 kilowatts and 500 newton meters in most variants, while the Ranger's 2.0 liter bi-turbo produces 154 kilowatts and 500 newton meters. Hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe for more such interesting content.